Hey there. Hi. Howdy. Um. <clears throat> is everything okay? Yeah, it's sorting itself out. Okay. Why is why is Scarlet worried about Theodosia? Because I had to do something. What'd you have to do? I won't harm her, Gracie. But I won't let them know that. Okay? But there's some pretty big shit that I gotta do to get out. Like what? Like have a really big bargaining chip. I can't find Ruby to do it. So I had to go for Theo instead. Bargaining for what? To leave. Why do you want to leave? Because I don't want to do this. I don't want to be a part of the cult. And I don't have any options. You Everyone feel like else, you're forced to stay? I am. Ethan told me that uh, I, I had to come work for him. And I could never leave. And if I ever tried, he'd kill me. I'm the only one that seems to have that. And it's all because of what I did. Back in the what past. Did, what did you do? Killed his dad. Oh. Took his vengeance from him. And I owe him something back. But without a bargain and chip, I, I, I don't have a play here. You know? Yeah, I can understand. But I ain't gonna hurt her, Gracie. But I'm gonna make people think that I will. But I won't. Do you mind if I stay with you guys so that she... I know that she's okay? Well, we're getting ready to push on. Gotta stay moving. You know how it is. I know. I can go with you guys. I don't think that's a good idea either. Why? Because it's something I gotta settle for myself. I can't risk anything else. I need to make sure that she's okay. I'm and that she's gonna be okay. Because she's my friend. She's mine too, and she's helping me out big time. She's gonna save my life at the end of the day. You understand? I want to talk to her about it. Go for it. I'm sorry, Gracie. Oh, you're doing real good, boy.
It's a good thing we both have pinkies then. Did I not write wanna fake my pinky? I wanna keep my pinkies too. What kite and what kite? Do you want Gracie to come with us? Can shite? I'm asking you. Miss Miss Gratiti, do you want to start? I would love to. Okay. Alright, yeah. go man up. Okay. Alright. You have a good chat. Did you put flowers on us, Grace? Yeah, I see. You're beautiful. No easies. No, you are. No easies. Look, Gracie, I just I need a bargain and chip that's big enough to make a statement to let me go. I understand. All right. Mm -hmm. I just I don't know you too well, and it makes me feel better, you know, knowing that Theodosia's safe. Yeah, she's safe. Mm -hmm. There's I wouldn't hurt her. But I need them to not know that. Okay. All right. Um, I have to. I'm trying to check telegrams when I can, but I gotta do it quick. I understand. Thank we you, Gracie. We feel faster. All right. Sorry, Theo, for going through that bush. He's fine. Don't worry, baby. Just yell at the bush. <laughs> baby, you evil bush. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where's oh, hey Teddy? Because he sent a telegram saying that. Um. I don't know. Uh, we kind of got split up. Hmm. Uh, I think they might have went towards Blackwater. They said All something right. about going this way, and I just had my mind set on... Because he said they'll either be in Rhodes, Blackwater, or the Homestead. And right. it seemed logical with the direction that you guys went that it was possibly the Homestead. So well, when, when we last saw you, I dipped around and headed a completely different direction at a, after I got out of your sight, so... Oh, well... I just went towards the You're homestead because that made you did sense. Well. The only reason he <laughs> sent a telegram, so we, we got it at Wallace, and I noticed Scarlet's yeah. horse was in Wallace, so we were yeah, careful. The, the horse has been there for a while, actually. All right. Hmm. For hours now. Interesting. Yeah, I was actually wondering whose horse that was at first. Gotcha. It's the Red Arabian, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that that's the one that's been there for a while. All right, if you want to go pick some flowers, sweetie, go for it. I'll just be a real quick okay. second, okay? Gracie, please don't try to take her. I'm not going to try and take her. Thank you. Have you found any good flowers?
right, y'all ready? Perfect. Alright. There you go. I got flares in my hair, Miss Kai. You look very beautiful. I also so, put some flares in your horse's tail. I <laughs> braided it. Thank you. <laughs> so we're gonna head up into the mountains. Um, up to where Ethan and Ruby got married. Up in that area. So we got a little bit of a ride, alright? Okay. I'm not sure where they got married. The flares! Yeah, it's up in Amarino. One oh, okay. of them northernmost roads up there. Hmm. Alright, you ready? E. Wait, so in the snowy mountains? Yep. Oh! That's like, where I live. Aren't all the mountains stony? Well, I live up on Hagen. Yeah. But I know those are that area really well. Except when I get lost in the blizzards. <laughs> it's yeah, that's really never easy. Fun. We were out in tall trees earlier, after mm -hmm. I took her, and we spent the night, and as we were mm -hmm. on our way out, there were two Comanche that stopped mm -hmm. us, asked us what we were doing there, and they were really nice and let us pass. Oh. Ooh. One of their names was like Bayer. Running Bear, I think. So might. I love bears. Is it when they're running at night? I love bears when they're not trying to gnaw my face off. Is it me? Did you know I'm a bear key? A what? A bear key. What's that mean? It's like a bear, but also a key. You know, you like, meow, meow. I don't understand. Oh, um, bear cat? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, I thought you were saying a bear kit. I'm like, I don't no. know what the fuck a kit is. It's not easy, it's not easy. Hey. My brother, Mr. Saeed, she's trying to leg like it. My mind my bear kit. His highs is big bear, and then our other brother, Mr. Cop, is little bear. So I'm bear kit. <laughs> I hope I'm not intruding, though. No, you're not. Okay. You were, I would tell you. All right. But you can be a testament. Oh. Miss mm -hmm. <laughs> Tiger's real nice. Oh, she's a sweetie. She's. Is she catching <gasps> up? I can't see behind me. Yeah, she's good. Okay. One time I fell off the face rock. Well, that ain't good. No, everybody fell off the face rock. Wait, what ain't good? Falling off Falling the rock. Falling off the, the face rock. Yeah, that, that's bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that ain't good at all. Mr. Nicolai went still off too. Yeah, I heard about him. Mm hmm. Hmm. -hmm. Remember the song that we practiced together? Oh. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, he's not. I think she's cute. What is she see? The rock? Go make sure she's oh, alright. Oh, he's not. Are you alright? Right? Ow. Oh, I got thrown off my horse. You okay? Oh. I smacked my shoulder. <clears throat> mm. I'm fine. Are you oh, sure? Guys. We can stop yeah. if you need it. Nah, it's good. We'll be going into the snow anyway. It'll feel better in the cold. Not yet. There's no snow up here yet. Oh, I know. I know. But we're oh, going to be getting... going into the snow. Oh, we will this way? Eventually. Oh, God. This is a terrible path. Yep. Hold on real tight. He's mine. Oh, Christ. I haven't been up here in a long time. <sighs> Look at that view, though, you huh? You can see everything from here. Yeah, you can. That's why I love the top, the mountain tops. Yeah. yeah. Like, 
This reminds me. Let's go take a look over here real quick. Careful with your foot and... Careful. <gasps> How's that for a view? Up here with birds. Oh. You imagine oh, if this was your... Birds. Those birds are evil. <laughs> what am I? They poop on your shoulder when you're trying to watch the sunrise. Oh. Place is not bad. Bad birds. Do you imagine Why what your view would be if you were a bird? Always have a oh, view like no. this? Or better? Yeah, oh, but the people bored. would be shooting at me. They are. <gasps> we don't want that. I don't like Scarlet was trying to rope some boards the other day. <laughs> really? I've tried doing that before. Hmm. He's sitting kitchen. In. <laughs> have you ever tried, tried shooting fish? Yep. No. I shoot fish all the time. <laughs> but then you have a bullet in your... That goes through them. You just gotta... You just gotta pick it up. Oh. There's the fort down there in front of us. Are these the titties? Yep, Fort Wallace. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Pass it on the left. You comfortable still? He... Alright. He saw your mines in the fire. Yeah, it sure is. I once was on a mountain. That mountain had some rocks. Yay! Or you could say it was a big rock. A and big it rock. had a bunch of dirt. Dirt, 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 it's a great traveling song. I love traveling songs. I'll sing one then. We're going on a bear hunt. Are we? Yeah. Well, now you can repeat after me. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Alright, we're going on a bear hunt. We're going on a bear hunt. To see what we can see. To size what we can size. To, s to find what we can find. To find what we can find. To smell what we can smell. To smells what we can smell. We're going on a bear hunt. Our guys are not on a bear hunt. Rawr! Rawr! <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hey! Excuse us. So, you remember what I said, right, Theo? That I, the I could die from this? You remember that? Uh-huh. Okay. I want you to know that if I... If they shoot me, it's okay. All right, and I don't want you to feel like you, it was your fault at all. Can you promise me? Okay. Yeah, if they have to shoot me, it's fine. If they have to kill me, it's all right. It's not your fault. It's my own doing. And you did everything I asked, and even more because you're a beautiful folk. Okay. I just want you to be happy. I'll be happy. I'll be free still. That's what I want. Okay? Okay. <gasps> Look at those flowers! Yeah, that's why I chose this spot. Oh, it's so pretty. I need you to do me another favor. Hmm. And I probably don't have the right to ask. And you can definitely say no. Hmm. I need you to stay back here with the shack, okay? Okay. I don't care if you want to go around and, and look at flowers and all that, but I, hmm. you just please stay next to the shack. Okay. Thank you, sweetie. Let's do I'm 
gonna put some flowers in your hair. Why, can I put some flares in your hair, please? Sure, let me take my hat off. How do I get up there? I'm gonna get you your hair. Hold on. Don't move. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Put down your rifle right now. Put down the rifle or I'll blow up your fucking head. Gracie, please move. Put down okay. the rifle right now. You really want to do this? I ain't pointing at y'all. I put my gun down with the Doge's over here. She ain't leaving. So I hope you can't prepare to kill me. Because that might be what you might have to do here. We will kill you if it means saving her. So uh, let's, uh, let's try to work this out so that uh, no one has to die. Shall we? Listen. What's going on? Hmm? Just trying to get myself free of this. That's it. But none of you can what? make this decision, so she's going to be leaving with me. No, she's not. Scarlet, she is. She has to. No, <clears throat> she's not. It, it, it's, it's okay. Um, I, I, I'm, I'm helping. Okay, so now, well, so what do you want out of this cell? Uh, uh, Miss Kaliana? It's fucking Kali, Delphine. It's always been Kelly. Kelly, you fuck. It's not Kaliana. It's fucking Kelly. So, okay. Kelly, what do you want out of this? I can't get it from you. I can't get it from Scarlet. Who can you get it from? It's gotta be Ruby or fucking Ethan. They're not around right now. Well, then she ain't going nowhere. You want to hold her until... Uh... Yeah, it could take days. It could take weeks. Yeah. It's That's not what it's happening. Gonna... Yes, it is, Scarlet. Why don't you just leave? Why don't you just go off to New Austin somewhere? The fuck am I going to do in the desert, huh? Okay. If you want us to, we can arrange a meeting between you and Ethan or you and Ruby if you want. Mm -mm. Theo's not leaving my side until that day, till that time. Well, uh, my fight is not going to work for you too well. Delphine. Um, it's, it's fine, Miss Theo. Um, I've got to stay with her. It's, it's, it's fine. As, as history. I want to hear. So, uh, no, no. So, Miss Kelly, no, I'd be most, sorry, Miss Kelly, uh, Kelly, I'll, I'd be most appreciative if you are to be quite clear with us on it. As to exactly what you yeah. want, uh, perhaps we can find a way Stop to work this out. Towards the Adosia. Not pointing at the Adosia. You're pointing towards her. You could easily shoot her. Uh, and uh, Kalia, Kali? Scarlet. Uh, don't you worry, because uh, I can very easily uh, blow your head off from here. There's not really much you can do to her. Scarlet. I'm not here what? because that's something that scares me, Delphine. I'm okay, not here well, for you. Put I'm not here down. for either of y'all. Then why do they have to drag the daughter into this? Because it should have been Ruby, but Ruby's not around. Tell Delphine to put her gun down, too. You want me to shoot her, Delphine? No. Then put your fucking but gun down. Delphine, I don't have my... I have not down. raised one... I haven't raised my weapon once at either of you. But you've threatened to uh, do so at my friend. Yeah, she's my friend, too. Then uh, you would, if she was your friend, you would, you would not do that to her? No, I probably would. 
then she's no friend of yours. She, she's, yeah, you know, I was a lover. And if, if she, 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 she might, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> she's not going to shoot you off, Idora. Idora, I'm with you guys and, you know, your, your beef with Callie, but don't point guns towards Theodosia. That's okay, where so, I'm going to step so in and you say want no. Ruby, right, Kaliana? It's Kali? fucking Kali, Delvin. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit stressed currently. So, Kali, you want Ruby? Mm -hmm. Or Ethan. <laughs> or Ethan. But I have to do this to get away from y'all. I'm to stop doing this. I can't just walk off on my own accord and be good. That's not how this works with me. So then, uh, why don't you take someone else instead of her? Take me instead. Yeah, no. or like, either of us will be happy to we'll no. step in and it's that is not happening. I appreciate that, but it is not. I can't. So, what do you want from Ethan and Ruby right now? I want to be released of the cults. Well, uh, we can relay this information to them that you held her up. I can say that I shot you in the hip, and I'm sure that uh, they will uh, declare you dead to the cults, and you can walk away from here scot free. That won't be good enough. I know you don't understand, and I understand that, and that's okay. But it's bigger than that. It's an oath that I made to Ethan based on shit that had happened in the past, okay? I can't leave. I'm here forever until I'm dead. And if I try to leave, I'm dead. Okay? Well, uh, it seems like something you can take up with Ethan, can you not? Well, that's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> well, then, why do you, why do you need Theodosia here for that? Because you she's don't. my bargaining chip. She's not the, then you can use S for our bargaining no, chip. No, I can't. Or, what if I give you my word to get Ethan to you? Or Ruby? Then Theodosia will go away with them. And you. Okay, so if I give you my word right here that I will ensure that you can have a meeting with Ethan now, just you two, would you uh, let Theodosia go? Or with Ethan or Ruby? Ethan's too hot headed, so it would probably have to be Ruby at this okay, fucking point. So I can give you my word on I'll my life. I'll talk to that stupid bitch. Okay, I will give you my word on my life that I will ensure that you can have a one on one meeting with Ruby on a. Uh, on your discre at your discretion, and uh, we can we can talk this together, but that requires you to release Ruby. I mean, rele sorry, release Theodosia. That is not happening. Are you not hearing me? Yeah. I'm just, Delphine, I'm just trying. I'm stuck in a real bad shit situation here. All right. It's nothing personal, at all towards either of y'all, and I'm sorry I have to put you in it. I don't have any other options, okay? Please don't involve the law either. No, I've ensured that the law are not involved. At least when it comes to the on uh, me and Scarlet's behalf. I have no intention of that. That will just get things more muttered and I don't trust them in this situation. All right. Because my intent is not to hurt her or worse. No. I, I, you seem to very much want not to. What you want is a meeting with Ruby and or Ethan. Right? I just want word with that I'm clear to go. And it has okay. to be from one of them. Because I know it's, like, if I hear it from Ethan, it's good. If I hear it from Ruby, I know it comes from him. Okay. So what if I, uh, what I can guarantee, that I will, I will, I promise you on my life, I'll get you there word you're clear. If you release your dojo. That's not, that's not happening, Del. I'm not releasing Theodosia. She's with me until this is resolved. Days, weeks, whatever. <laughs> I'll make sure she she's eating. Money. I'll make sure she's got the water she needs and everything that she needs to keep herself safe, healthy, and away from harm. I'll give you my word on that. I know this doesn't make sense. I get it. But they may add it. Why? I can't just let you like, walk away Scarlet, with her. Scarlet, you know I you... talked to you, right? Yeah, no, you lied to me, too. Now how I'm did like I, liars. How did I lie to you? You talked to me about Ruby. And it was going to be her. It really was. 
Then why can't it be her? Because she ain't around and I don't have time. Then uh, make, give yourself time. I am. But Theo. You could Put disappear your arms down. You, knew, you could disappear to New Austin. I, I ain't could going find there. Way I can get Ruby or Ethan to you. I just release your daughter. Mm -mm. Miss, Miss Theo, this is how it's gonna work. She, she likes me. It's fine. Bye, everybody. I'll, I'll be fine. We saw Teddy Gracie and some other chick over at uh, the Flatneck station. We were doing a telegram and then checked again at Wallace. And Teddy had mentioned going and meeting at the homestead, so we rode over there. And that's where we found Gracie, and Gracie asked to come along. At first I said no. And then I allowed her to go and speak to Theo privately. And then I agreed that Gracie can come along with us to make sure that Theodosia is safe. Those are my only terms, girls. That is it. Do not make me do something you don't want to see happen. Because I'm desperate, and I am backed into a corner, and I'm tired of being in a fucking cage. And I'll let that sink into your heads for just a moment. Oh, dear. You make damn sure if you're going to point that again and you better fucking use it and you better be quicker on your trigger than I am on mine. And, gone, and looking at you holding that rifle in such a mysterious way, I'd factor, the fucking, I'd factor it differently if I were you. Do we have your guarantee that Theodosia will not be hurt? Yes, you do. If Ethan or Ruby is not compliant with your demands, will you hurt her? Unsure. Because even if Ethan and Ruby are not compliant with your demands of you, whether you hurt her or not, it will not change anything for you. Something happens to her, it's like all going to be ten times worse. I'm no, aware. Notice. So, why don't we just, so I'm happy if you want to use, you can let her be a bargaining chip, but... It to me like, if they will not release you for holding her hostage, they will not release you for killing her, right? Right. Or hurting her. So, even if Ethan or Ruby don't give you what you want, promise me you won't hurt or kill her. She's family, Dale. I love promise her. Promise me you won't hurt or kill her. <sighs> you want us to go now? That's all you have to promise. You don't go back on your word. You give us your word, but you will not hurt or kill her. We'll be happy to leave. <sighs> but I want your word in blood. You won't get my word in blood. But I will give you my word that I will not harm her if they decide otherwise. No, kill. I won't scratch her, cut her, shoot her, injure her in any capacity. You have my word on that. If their word is insufficient enough. Oh, and it is regardless of on, uh, how they decide that... Uh, Upon you leaving or leaving their duty, leaving their services and whatnot. Mm -hmm. yes. All right. But I'll make sure she's safe for the time being, however long it takes for you to figure that out. We're going to be moving around a lot. You guys can have a conversation with Theo if you'd like. May I have a conversation with you? Yep, she's going to stay right here. All right. Hey. Hey, Theodosia. Mm -hmm. 
How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm ready. It's, it's fine. I'm just trying to help you. I know. Okay. And uh, you're not Mr. You're doing a wonderful job, did you, Asha? Mm -hmm. Alright. Mm. Everything's going to be fine. Mm. Uh, I, have a, I have a condition for you. Uh, mm -hmm. it, it's, a, it's a lesser, the less problem. But please, can you release her by the by Sunday? I very much would like to go on a scavenger hunt with her. Well, that all depends on Ruby and Ethan. But I'll do my very best to accommodate your request, though. Is uh, I'm willing to work with you in order to uh, better expedite this process if we need to. Uh, go handle it. Communicate through telegrams, and we'll do what we have to do. All right. Look, I know that this is, I know this isn't awesome, trust me, I get it. But I, I don't have any other opportunity to get rid of this for myself, okay? It was going to be a, it was going to be Ruby why, originally. Why, why did you have to say that, though? She's the, she was an option that was presented to me. And I'm sorry to all you girls. Still. No, there's not. Not to get what I need. But if I, like, so it all, I'll just explain it to you. Could you please back up? Me? Yes. Thank you. Okay. Long time ago, I had known Ethan for quite some time. His mother was killed by his father and his friends. I'm sure you've heard. Maybe not. And it was really bad. He was pretty fucked up, right? Like anyone would be in a situation like that. So I took it upon myself and I, I killed his I killed his pa. And he didn't never set well with him. Because he felt like that was his his thing to do for his own mother. Okay. So I've been sworn to him to repay that debt by coming to the cults. And I don't have the opportunity to leave like y'all do. It's I leave, I die. So I am at a, a situation here that I have to fix for my own future. And I know it looks really bad, and I am very sorry. I am. I really am, y'all. But I have no option to get myself out unless I have somebody that can bargain, that I can bargain with that means a lot to them. And that could be any of you, and I know. But, I, it <laughs> but it's Theo. And I don't have any other option. Okay. So you think whatever you'd like of me, that's fine. You want to hunt me down after this is over and put it into me, then that's fine too. You do what you think you have to do for you. I don't. I won't hold any ill will at all. But I can't do this anymore. I got my own life to do. And I hope you can understand that. So you talk with him and you see what you can do for me, all right? I will uh, do what I can to expedite the process of your release from their, uh, from your promise to them or whatever you call it. And uh, that is all, uh, that's all, uh, of course, tangent upon uh, Didoja's uh, safety, right? Yeah. All right. I don't feel what I tell you from the get-go. Like she didn't want to hurt me? Uh, I don't much care if you want to hurt her or not. What matters to me is whether you hurt her or not. We should probably really start thinking about caring about that shit going forward, Del, because I'd hate for you to fuck this up. I have no intention of doing so. May I leave some things for t Doja on the ground here? What? May I leave some things for t Doja on the ground here? What? Uh, food, mainly strawberry tarts. Yeah, you can leave it on the ground in front of her, then you can get the fuck out of here. Okay? 
because this thing, it's like a clock. It just keeps ticking and ticking and ticking in the background of my fucking head. And it really irritates the fuck right out of me. You understand that? Delphine? Mr. Luck. I go talk to that bitch and get her fucking approval. Take care, Scarlet. <sighs> oh, my God. I'm glad the mini got shot. <sighs> Me, too. It was really scary. It was really scary. Whew. Are you okay? I'm fine. All right. I think that went alright. I think the it Mr. Boomer Boom talks to you, so hey. I love how people are like, oh, I'm holding a shotgun. I'm only aiming at this person, but I don't realize that shotguns spray. Mm-hmm. Yep. And from her distance, she totally would have hit both of us. It's a good work. I was like, mm, no, mm -mm, no, you you would hit Theodosia. Yeah. <laughs> Put it down. <laughs> oh, that would, that would have been terrible. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> well, I'm glad that you did you did that for me. I see. As I said, I'm I'm gonna help try and keep you safe. Is it just me or they get here like real quick? Like real quick. <laughs> Well, it was a really good time, and you yeah. were here like a couple minutes before. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Well, um, do y'all want to stay here the night, or? I'm good with whatever. All right. The way we have, just in case we have a little bit of shelter, in case the weather gets worse. Mm -hmm. And you can play in your flower field. Gracie, you'll be my, my testament, won't you? What's that supposed to mean? So, like a last will and testament? <laughs> I guess. Because that's the only thing that I know testament from is the last will and testament. So, basically, if everything goes wrong and I don't make it, you'll be the one that maybe paints a better picture of me after all is said and done. I'm not really good at painting, but I can, you know, no, use your words. It's explain the situation. Yeah. <sighs> I thought for sure they're gonna shoot me, and if I didn't have her, I would have gotten shot. I feel. Are you hungry, Gracie? Um, a little. All right. I have some meat. Let me get it. See you, sweetie. Please stay close, though, okay? Because there is wolves out Bye. here. Oh, okay, okay. Hold on, boy. Let me move you. Alright, Gracie, I got some pork loins and some venison. I cooked it prior, which, what sounds good for you? Uh, venison. Venison? Alright.
There you go, sweet girl. Thank you. You're welcome. Theo, you hungry? Hmm? Theo, are you hungry? Theo? So what is this place? I honestly don't know. <laughs> I've heard it referred to as the witch's cabin. I don't know. Oh. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, Gracie, do you have any questions about any of this? Um. No. I mean, I can understand it. Does it make sense? Am I being a dipshit? <laughs> I wouldn't say you dipshit. Um, I know it ain't the brightest idea, but... Definitely not the brightest idea. I mean, at least you're not shooting a deputy in the neck on accident. <laughs> done that before. <laughs> you've, done, you've done that? Uh, yeah. The deputy was off duty, but the deputy was saying all this crazy shit like she chopped up my sister Saskia and fed her to some cannibal named Tobias. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That sucks. <laughs> uh, so I took her to the gallows and I was going to hand her over to the other deputies and then accidentally shot her and another man at the same time, both in the neck. Well, at least you're alright. I just wanted to make sure if you had any questions or anything regarding this, since you're with us, that I would make myself available to answer them. Um, first question, whose blood is on the floor? Uh, good question. Not ours? Well, I mean, at least I hope not. And I am bleeding. Uh, you don't look yeah, to be let's, bleeding. Let's, let's step out of the bloody shack. Alright. <laughs> Being outside has never seen better. Holy shit, that was close. Yeah. Um. Did you get enough to eat? Uh. I'm always hungry. Alright, so I have a little bit of. I think pork loin and venison as well, so. You want I think I have some some salted beef in my saddlebag, so. All right. Well, let me know so. if you need anything. 